What's going on with the rise of right-wing sentiment in Western Europe? Answer. Okay, this is gonna go great. Western Europe and the EU has always had illegal immigration. People trafficking from North Africa to Southern Europe, mainly Spain, Italy and Greece, and from Eastern Europe. Nothing new here. But since the Syrian refugee crisis, the problem had become more prevalent with right-wing politicians blaming crime and housing issues on them. Now to some extent the lack of integration has caused some crime issues, usually legal immigration requires that you provide a full legal history to make sure you don't have any criminal record, while refugees and migrants taken in by these ways have skipped that part, so it's an easy mark. But it's not one-sided. You look at the Nordic countries like Sweden which have had a very welcoming attitude are now suffering the consequences of their actions with increase in crime and lack of integration. Some areas have become no-go zones. France has gotten a bit pissed off with cars burning in the suburbs every time Samiom says something bad about Muslims. The thing is the countries where the rise of the right wing is due to immigrants it hasn't actually been due to the EU immigration or refugee policies. Britain. Most immigrants are from the Indian subcontinent and Commonwealth ex-colonies. France. Most immigrants are from their old North African colonies like Algiers. Italy has always had the same problem like Spain has with Morocco. Libya is just across the coast from so then Italy. Mix that with the right in Italy always being from the posh north. Add to that the chaos in Libya when Qatifi fell which flooded Italy with migrants by boat. The housing crisis also made things worse. Here in Spain the left-leaning government has made it harder to expel tenants that stop paying rent if you own more than one house. Mix that with the fact that services like Airb and B have made inner-city housing a luxury, since they are basically all rented out to tourists. It has basically jacked up the prices of housing, as companies see houses as commodities instead of a resource for citizens. Add to this Russian and Chinese propaganda which want to push Europe to the right as well as destabilize it, Brexit crippled the British economy. The Spanish government is currently being held hostage to Catalan nationalists. Marie Le Pen in France will probably cause a shift in the French EU cooperation, as well as their support for Ukraine. So it's not one thing. There are valid concerns where the left has accepted mass immigration without safeguards or integration, which has made some European countries less safe, as well as not being able to tackle the housing crisis. But at the same time you have Russian propaganda, magnifying the problem to push forward anti-EU extreme right parties into the front line of European politics.